HJK. From Global Act Salvation Foundation. We are here as the Nigerian Embassy where we are going to the liberation of the new executive of the new Malaysia. Stay tuned and watch the show. Ajuda Bile No matter where you go, make you not forget First, I have highlighted this in my speech. We should all be proud to hold the green passport. That privilege also requires us to behave in a way that people will see us and be happy. So if you want to change, my God said, you have to be the change yourself. Some say, if you give respect, you give respect. My first advice is, whatever we're doing as Nigerian, we should impute dignity, truth, give out love, automatically people will give. If we give up, if we behave, I'll try to live in a community and we still have problems. The first thing is we try to resolve it. Peaceful, discussing, understanding the culture, and then we work. Remember, even in Nigeria, we have different cultures and we need to live together now. If we do that, I am very sure the, the people will appreciate us with live. Living among ourselves, we have to take effort to respect the love of each other. We should visit. But a situation where there is oppression, we will fight. I have just said, court. People go out and they fight in Nigerian business premises. They kidnap them. They don't do that to other nationalities. Why? That's why I said you should stop. People doing that will, will support the oppressed who will defend them. By defending them, you engender good citizenship from them. Those who need help, because Nigerians have businesses can, they can employ, they can help the other people. Those who need advice, we can give advice. We will share with others what we have. By that, we will build a united community in this family. First, we should go for peace. Ajuda Bile, no matter where you go, make you not forget. I have said it. If you give, you get. First of all, it's my leadership. I want to live above board, and I tell Nigeria to live above board. If we start fighting ourselves, courtism, now, among ourselves, involved in drugs, involved in this internet scam, which is known to everybody, no one would like to associate with you. Be the change you want to see. That change is leadership, is living above board. That's why I said we will fight courtism. We will, we will, we will chase them. Those in drugs, stop. In your business, relocate. We will follow them up. 
Of course, if they catch you in the internet scam, it's your problem. If you remove these three, these three vices, you walk freely. They don't harass me. Because you ask me, I have my company. I'm a consultant. I have my house. My children, everybody go. They don't harass me. But when they see that people, you say, what are you doing? And when they are fighting, that's the problem. So we are telling those people stop. Those are the bad eggs. You and I have a problem. We have a duty. Tell them to stop. If you cannot stop, try it. But the issue is, this is Yoruba man. I cannot walk. This is Yoruba. I cannot say this is this one will leave them. We are making it. I said in my report, it's painful for the father to take his son to the police. I am the father now. They don't stop. I will take them. But if they behave well and they are oppressed by the community, we will fight. We will follow. Up. We will use legal means. We will use the lawyers to protect our rights. But first, we have to be right. Once we are right and you are oppressed, we will fight. We will take the lawyer. I told you already we will get the lawyer. That's, That's it. Those are two ways. You can't carry soldiers. If you are oppressed, get a good lawyer. Make a mess of them. They will apologize. Or get get uh, compensation. That's it. But we have to be the change you want to see. No matter where you go, make you not forget. Why are we just concluded the swearing in ceremony of the new NIDO executive in Malaysia? The new NIDO executives are expected to partner with the High Commission in addressing issues of Nigerians. I have in my talk with them advised that they should always emphasize the sense of community that should exist within all Nigerians in Malaysia. So we should be law abiding, we should be up and doing in our responsibilities and uh, we have uh, certain uh, perception issues that uh, we have to address with the new NIDO executive. We have done well with the previous executive and uh, we hope and pray that uh, it will be a continuation with the new executive. They have given me their words that they are there for us and we are all here for the Nigerian community. We will do all we can within our power and within our reach to partner with the NIDO and Health authorities here to make sure that Nigerians are comfortable in pursuing what they do every day. And uh, our advice has always been they should be law abiding and should avoid uh, uh, issues with the law. Uh, the NIDO executive has assured us of their cooperation, of their capacity, and ability to do what they should. And we are here for them and with them, and hopefully. Uh, to the glory of God and our country. Thank you. My name is Matodar Bashori. I'm a civil engineer here. I've been working in Malaysia for the last 18 years. Currently the director of BHR in Buna Sundra Barada, a Malaysian based company. And um, this company has been doing a lot of uh, jobs regarding palm oil development. And we have almost 10,000 hectares of uh, plantation in Bosa, Malaysia. So we have been trying to introduce a business venture between Malaysia and Nigeria. Thank you so much. Ajuda Bilay, no matter where you go, make you not forget. As the vice president of Nigeria in diaspora, some of our program, which was firstly to normalize my needle mind document with ROS, I was at ROS and I see that the document here does not reflect the names of the Nigerians here. So, those are the first thing we have to normalize. 
Then the second thing is we have just con constituted or a legal team of three lawyers to represent Nigerians in Malaysia in case of any problem so that at least they will solve their problem in the in immediate terms. Another aspect of it is to establish an office which we have just located in the John area for the services of Nigerians here so that we will have a dedicated staff here to solve all the problems emanating for all Nigerians in Malaysia here. Also, we are trying to bring in all segments of the Nigerian community, like the Igbo, the Yoruba, the Aousa, the people from Middle Belt, the people from South South, they have their, their different association here. So we are trying to make them an associate member of Nidoma in Malaysia. Ajuda Bile, no matter where you go, make you not forget. Okay. Yeah, because they said uh, charity begins at home. People will respect you once you respect yourself. One of the first things we are intended to do is to make sure that Nigerians themselves place themselves in a very vintage position so that Malaysia themselves will give them a good respect. And to do this, we are trying to call in a meeting of all Nigerians here to tell them some of the limits and the opportunities which are found in Malaysia here for them to do that. And again, the Nidomai, in conjunction with the Nigerian Embassy in Malaysia here, have just liaised with the Home Ministry to make sure that the Home Ministry respects us and make sure that Nigerians in Malaysia here are giving the necessary support so that they will be honored wherever they go. And some of these programs will be disseminated to all the various segments of the Nigerian community in Malaysia. Thank you so much. Ajuda Bile, no matter where you go, make you not forget area. Oh, area. Oh, Nana Inja, Tio de Bati Lake Bada Wale. Oh, Wale. Oh, how I wish, say, I fit reach you anywhere you day. You day. Far away, that one no say make you the Bonaria, oh, motherland, yo. Chine do somebody borrow you, we go, make you travel, go Chicago, remember.